Hey you guys, it's your girl Fire here. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how I do my DIY foot pedicures. I do my own feet, I do my own nails. I don't do it often as I should. I don't keep up with it, but when I do want to do them, this is what I do, okay? Sheesh. Not only is it cost effective, it is easy to do. You just have to invest in a few things and you know, you can use these things over and over again, over a period of time, as long as you don't break it, of course. Um, I'm gonna show you how I get my baby smooth heels. I'm gonna show you how I cut my cuticles, paint my toes with gel, because at the salon, you guys already know that it's about $30 just for the service, not including tips, and then, the gel like the gel is like an extra 10 15 dollars i'm not cheap i'm just very budget friendly if you are interested in this video then stay to the end of it like comment and subscribe and let's get to it now if your toes look like that all 2019 all summer 2019 you should be ashamed of yourself but you know what that's real life and i'm gonna show you how to fix it okay budget friendly here we go i'm gonna take some of this acetone this is maximum strength acetone all it takes is like a couple swipes and the nail polish comes right off but i like to take off my nail polish before i put it in the foot bath and then along with that i like to shave my toes you could wax your toes. It'll actually be a lot more polished if you do it that way because the bulbs of the hair wouldn't be showing through as you see like the black dots that's on my uh, toes. But if you don't have um, the, the strength to wax, then go ahead and just shave it all off. It's just a lot cleaner that way. Or if you like the, the hair, by all means, leave it there. <laughs> Moving right along, I am gonna soak my feet for about 10, 15 minutes in my foot bath. If you don't have one of these, you can definitely just use your tub. I've done that before. But I put in some water, put in some of my body wash, and then um, I press the button, it activates the bubbles and it also heats up the water. Now, one of these is pretty cool to have because it's very relaxing, kind of gives you that salon experience from when you sit in the chair and stuff like that. And if you want a little nice light massage, all you have to do is just rub your foot against that attachment right there. And what's great about this foot bath is that it comes with different attachments. So if you don't want, you know, this one right here, you want something a little bit more rough, they got an attachment for that. But Invest in one of these is pretty cool and it's very affordable. After soaking my foot, I take one of them and I put it down on a foot towel or any old towel would do. And then I pat it dry and go in on my cuticles. I take my cuticle cutter, cut around the nail beds, cut around the nails. And this is just going to give it a fresh new look and at the same time cut away the dead skin that is around there that we don't need. Okay, and um, since you've soaked it, your cuticle should be soft enough for it to be very easy for you to pry around. So you just keep doing that until all your toes are nice and clean. Now after I do that, I go in with my file and kind of file down the nail bed just to make it nice and smooth and clean. Gets off the extra grit that is on the nail bed that may have built up and all of that and then um, I wipe it down, buff it out and this makes for a very smooth application when you put on your nail polish. So do not skip this step. I know you guys see the glow up. She's coming along, she's coming along. Now we're gonna do our heels. This is how I get my baby smooth heels with a no file callus remover gel. This is a chemical gel that just breaks down all your callus and all you have to do is just leave it on for five minutes. Now what I do is leave it on there and then instead of it just being a mess and me holding my feet up, I take a shower cap and insulate it 
so that this chemical doesn't get everywhere because it is very very strong this is the extra strength you know catalyst remover and it will burn so please be careful when you are using this if you're not comfortable using this just use the regular file it's time to finally paint and you can get very creative or you can keep it very simple I like to keep it very simple on my toes and go crazy on my fingernails but I like to put down a base first and then go in with the color and then go back in with a second color coat and then top that off with a clear coat but for my gel polish I like to use either the Sally Hansen miracle gel or the one step wonder by wet and wild those are gel polishes and they curate with no lamp so just natural sunlight is going to curate it and give it that gel polish finish both of those are very affordable and you can find at walmart the sally hansen one is like 7.99 and i think the wet and wild one step wonder is 4.99 so after i paint my toes i put on my cuticle oil rub it down and then put some on my foot and that is it Hashtag team pretty feet. This is what our feet should be looking like all 2019 Especially since it's flip-flop season ladies get your feet together Okay, watch this video do it yourself. It's affordable and it's easy to do and I hope you guys enjoyed it if you did then give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next video